don't know what to say. Hey, how you doing? Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Hey guys, it's Jackie. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is the long-awaited second video on my channel. A tutorial on my go-to bronzed, glowy look. This is the look completed. So without further ado, let's jump right in. I first like to start off really hydrated, drink a lot of water, and then I cover my face with a nice serum. Next, I like to add over a facial oil on my lips and my whole face. Next, I'm gonna go in with a vitamin infused setting spray and then a little bit of my primer while it's still wet. I like to massage this all over my face before I apply my foundation. My foundation's an airbrush foundation, so it's a bit light on the skin, but it does provide coverage. I also like to blend it out with a beauty blender. Moving in to brighten my under eyes, I like to use this NARS concealer. I like to put it on spots of my face that I want to highlight or bring forward. Going with Laura Mercier powder, I'm just going to go underneath my eyes to bake them with a little rolling motion. Now I'm going to set my face all over with this ambient lighting powder and a fluffy brush. Warming up my face, I'm going to use this color from MAC and the same brush just to buff out the edges of my face. Moving in to define my face even more, I'm going in with a soft contour color and a new brush. Buffing it out so it's not such a harsh line and then moving in with a tighter brush and a darker color to even further define my cheekbones. I'm going to warm up my face with this little blush from MAC. It's really warm and peachy and I really like it. I'm just gonna pat it on my cheeks so it's very light. You never want too much blush. Going in with a nice spam brush, I'm gonna take some matte highlight just to clean up under where I've contoured. And then with another brush, I'm gonna take the highlight and pull it down my nose. Going in with this palette, I'm going to take this color and define my nose even further. Baking the sides so it's more precise and knocking away excess powder. Again, I'm going to wet my face with the setting spray before I apply a highlight. Wetting your face before applying highlighter makes it shine even brighter. Sometimes I like to use my finger to go over my cupid's bow and down the line of my nose bridge. I also like to add highlighter above my eyebrows. In case you guys see that my eyebrows are done, I have a video to that right here separately. I'm going to move in with this brush and paint pot from MAC in the color Soft Ochre just to prime my eyes. Make sure you buff it out all the way. Going with this Sigma brush, I'm going to take the lightest shade from my Naked palette and coat my eyes with a base coat. To define my eyes even further, I'm going in with a light contour color and creating a slight crease. I'm going to diffuse the crease later, but first blending is key. Mixing matte highlight with the medium contour and a separate brush, I'm going to diffuse the harsh crease that I have formed. Going in with another brush, I'm going to tight line the lower end of my eyelid with the darkest color in the palette. Going in with the same brush, I'm going to highlight my eyebrow bone. Taking this fun magic pencil, I'm going to line the inner works of my eye with a bright white. Going in with a darker color, I'm going to run this along the waterline of my top lid, giving the illusion of fuller eyelashes. 
Coming in with the liquid eyeliner, I choose to use a pen one because it gives me a more fine line. I'm going to give myself a nice defined cat eye winged liner. Moving in with another mascara, I'm going to press it into my lower lashes and wiggle them. Taking a separate mascara for my top lashes, I'm going to be using a rolling and pulling technique. Taking my favorite glue and a set of eyelashes, which I have cut in half, I'm going to apply these half set falsies to the corner of my eye for a nice flirty, fluttery effect. Now that we're done on eyes, let's move into lips. I like to exfoliate my lips before I lay down any product so there's no dry skin. I'm going in with this lip color and only applying it to the inside of my lips. Going over my lips with another lip gloss will help it shine and give a healthy glow. Taking the setting spray, I'm going to put it on my decolletage and highlight my collarbones. Lastly, I'm going to set my whole face again with this setting spray. This is the finalized look. I hope you guys really enjoyed this. It's great for the summer and going out to special events. It's very dewy and glowy. What do you want? Like and subscribe. Share this video with your friends. Or don't! It may never end up anywhere. I might just quit this YouTube thing. This is the last video. I said that in the last video, but I mean it this time. Like and subscribe!